everybody and welcome to episode number six of Don't Be a Fatty, our ASMR Beeper Ultimate Team series. Today we are back to the usual format of episodes uh, after the madness of Team of the Year and uh, we are obviously at our draft episode in the last video. And today we're returning back to somewhat a normality. Now, in the end of the last episode, I uh, provided a link to a poll, and it basically asked you guys yet again what positions we should prioritise upgrading. On screen now is the current team, or the team we finished the last episode with, and I want to thank everyone who got their responses in, and we'll get to those results in a bit, but before we get into that, we've got a fair packs and stuff which which we did open including a base to mid icon pack so without further ado i think we should just get started with that so here we go with the base or mid icon pack open for a good nation brazil netherlands something like that this isn't live i know what we get so icon german striker and here's where i realize yeah this is an absolute rotter an absolute stinker we get closer base closer not not even mid closer it's possibly one of the worst icons we could have got basically all of the things that i packed in the team of the year uh packs i grinded into this and this is what i got for it absolutely shocking i mean he'd put Werner on Kim in our team but apart from that there's no positives to take now oh I'm really sorry I didn't get this on camera but I did some player pick SP uh, the SPCs to get some player picks and I got inform Callum Wilson I also got an inform Mkhitaryan who I actually put into the guaranteed 85 plus packs which you'll see shortly but I'm not going to get rid of Wilson because he's he's great in game and another thing we got was a future stars. It was only Diego Dallo, but still, I think that's a win. Now, I did do some more uh, player picks uh, to show you on camera, but I'll be honest, they were not the best. Here we get Ocampos, 82 rated. Here we go with Dembele, 81 rated. Look, 381 is literally the worst you can get. Here. Ramsey and in this one we managed to get a walkout but it's one of the, probably one of the worst walkouts you can get David Silva and then in the final one we get you know 83s across the board isn't bad so they weren't that successful and they went straight into this pack yes we got a do 85 plus rated rare players really I did this because it's almost guaranteed a walkout which obviously means an upgrade which is always nice and we do get a walkout. It's Slovenian. It's a goalie. I'm hoping it's all black, but it's not. Of course it's not. We get Andanovic. And at this point, I'm just hoping that there is a second walkout in this pack. So we secure two upgrades. And we do. David Ayer is chilling there. So two goalies, not great. But I then recycled them to put them into this again. So hopefully we could secure another upgrade for our team just to have, get somebody of better value as well we do get a walkout so that is an upgrade secured French centre mid Manchester United Paul Bogba so I actually I actually put him in the closer SBC um, by accident it was genuinely by accident so I was absolutely buzzing with this um, he might actually be able to fit in the team in future unfortunately not another walkout we get Milinkovic Savage but Bogba is good enough for me so now we move on to the upgrades. As I said, this is the current team. We've got Werner, we've got Fatty, we've got Vigo, and we've got some silver centre-backs. But apart from that, it's bronze players everywhere. Our Wolves right back recently moved to Ipswich. Uh, fun fact. But anyways, this, these are the results of the bowl. CDM won by a landslide. Then next we had goalkeeper and then right mid so using all of our pretty much all of our upgrades that we secured during team of the year draft and now there we have it we've put in robin we've put in de jong and we've gone with adol 
Robin is a card that I've used a fair bit and I love it. Obviously untradeable because it's a flashback card, but I was very, very eager to get him into my team. Obviously only two star weak foot. And then I also upgraded our right back who actually has 85 base. So hopefully it would do a slightly better job. So let's get into the games. So this was our opponent, game number one. And let me tell you that Maradona card was horrible to play against absolutely horrible but anyways we have a chance here with Vigo Vigo carrying it forward nice bit of skill gets free terrible ball Dion on the turn just puts it wide could have been a dream debut for Dion now Neymar brings it forward who I hate playing against Neymar and oh lovely Maradona smacks that in the net no problem <laughs> yeah Maradona was just so difficult to play against but anyways we continue forward with Vigo little drag over plays a ball into Fatty it's saved Werner follows up so we get a goal to our tally but not an upgrade of course he then comes forward and uh, Neymar and pulls a great save from Ador I kept that clip in there just because I wanted to show that Ador actually has some ability <laughs> but regardless of that from that corner uh, yeah not really sure what my player's doing there, just gets nutmegged. Robin coming forward with the ball. This guy was really good at defending, I have to say, and obviously Werner, absolute drag queen, drags it wide. And this guy was a very good player, I'll give him that. Um, yep, of course, who else but bloody Neymar. Making it 3-1, and then Neymar, oh, I mean, I don't even know how that goes in, but fair enough. And that game finished 4-1, and look at this guy's team, what on earth not there <laughs> and anyways he breaks forward with Robin and he just simply smacks it in good finish from him to be fair and uh, look where on earth are my centre backs I think centre back is definitely in the next place to upgrade up to rare golds definitely anyways we come forward with Werner and Fatty to secure us an upgrade oh what a ferocious shot that was <laughs> Anyways, we run forward with Robin, and I absolutely bottle it, but thankfully, Timo Werner is there to get us a goal back. Lovely stuff. And then, he comes forward again. L like, what is that defending? Again, more evidence that my centre-backs need upgrading. I need goals, desperately. And, uh, yeah, lucky ricochet, Robin goal, whatever, I'm over it. But we come forward. Werner plays it through to Fatty, and oh, what a finish. A little chip to secure us an upgrade, Fatty, you little beauty. And that finishes 4-2, but I'm just happy that we managed to get an upgrade. And here we go into the final game. Pogba coming forward for him, pass it into Zola, and this bit of skill was nice. Yeah, look at that. I mean, fair play. That little drag back worked an absolute treat. Anyways, Fatty comes forward, does a nice little turn, runs through, he backs off, and yes, another upgrade for us. Awesome. Because in this series, we don't care too much about the results yet, we just want upgrades. We come forward again, Sims on the left mid, because I move Fatty to striker, and Sims actually produces a bit of quality, and Werner heads home. Ever since I slew Timo Werner, he's actually performed Drowsers to oh, I can't I, I can't keep a straight face saying the team name. Drowsers down. Anyways, yeah, Rooney, nice. No idea why I brought my goalie up there, but hey, we all make weird decisions and of course on the stroke of half time. Waza smashes it top bins, as you do. Fantastic. But we're not done. We come forward with Robin. I simply knock it past and Robin smacks it in with his two star weak foot. You love to see that. You really do. You really love to see it. And straight from that kickoff, we intercept Fatty, plays it back to Sims, back to Fatty, who plays it into the feet of Robin, who at this point have moved to Striker, who then gives it to Fatty, and just watch this ruler, fake shot, another turn, and oh, isn't that just a beautiful goal? Another upgrade, courtesy of Fatty. Thank you very much. And that was probably one of the best goals I've scored this season so far. And you know what? We, we, we don't really need to talk about 
what happens from this point. We've got our upgrades. Let's just, you know, let's just focus on the positives because, yeah, we we kind of threw it quite badly, um, and it finished six four. But we did secure a good amount of upgrades. But I won't do them this episode. We will do them in the next episode potentially I'll see or maybe I'll just save them up a little bit more but I'm thinking I want to upgrade the centre backs but I will decide that next week but anyways everybody I hope you did enjoy this video uh, I'm kind of trying to do them like a little bit shorter a bit sort of quicker uh, making them a little bit more entertaining so I hope you I hope you did enjoy thank you again for all of your suggestions uh, for all your votes in the poll that will be polls coming um if you did enjoy this video please do leave a like subscribe if you are new 